hi guys and welcome back to my channel so before yeah before i knew this trick i used to sew my remnant rib to my way because by the time you want to use it the next morning it already has a skin on top so today i'm going to show you how to reuse remnant whipped cream so you don't have to waste it okay so this is my rem remnant whipped cream from the from two days earlier so i'm going to show you how to use it if you notice like there is a skin on top like when you leave whipped cream for a while it forms a skin on top of it and then like when you try to whip it up it has like lumps inside so usually most people throw it away so today i'm going to show you how to repurpose it to use again okay so now you're going to put in your mixer and then you're going to use the paddle attachment normally i know when you're making whipped cream you use the whip the whisk attachment but this time we're using the paddle attachment because like it doesn't overturn the whipped cream into butter and at the same time it breaks the lumps that has been formed inside like due to the skin that forms on top if that makes sense so what you want to do is you want to turn it for a while for maybe around one minute plus and see if there are still lumps inside if there's still lumps then you should close it scrape the sides of the bowl and then like whip it for a few more seconds maybe around 30 40 seconds and you want to whip it on like medium speed you don't want to whip it on high because you don't want it to overturn so once it is smooth what you have to do right now is we're going to be thinning it out to base heavy cream and then we're not going to be using the mixer anymore we're going to be using um our spatula because you don't want it to over whip and you want it to get a particular consistency and i'm going to show you how okay so i know like most people when you like use whipped cream and there are some remaining you throw it away because it's usually it easily gets compromised by bacteria so how to store it is take it and then put it in a bowl in an airtight container or better still you can wrap it in a cling film that helps like that saves it from forming a skin on top yeah so put it in an airtight container and then put it in the fridge and you, you don't want to like repurpose whipped cream that is more than maybe five six days that's just i don't know that's just pushing it <laughs> if that makes sense so what i'm doing right now is after you've kept it in an airtight container then you can put it in the fridge and when you want to use it then you can take it out and do this method that i'm teaching you how to repurpose it so right now we are thinning it and want to get it to a particular consistency and what we did was to add cream at the interval so add a little and stir add another little and stir kind of like that <laughs> so that was what we did and now we have this beautiful like perfect pipeable consistency of whipped cream and it is really delicious so this is the final product of what i made with it and it was so pretty and the owner liked it so thank you guys and give me a thumbs up if you like this video and i'll see you in my next tutorial bye